actually for Middle East. Since the First World War, uh, Arab countries were divided into pieces, but we also, unfortunately, cannot ignore continuous interference of the foreign powers in every, in every country. And foreign doesn't mean it's America or Russia or Iran. It's, I'm sorry, it can be all of the region. Yeah. Okay. I mean, look what happened to Syria. Mm -hmm. You know, I am not a politician. Yeah. I am not saying the regime is good or bad. This is not my job. But in the Arab uprising uh, eight, nine years ago, uh, we have, you know, some interesting examples. Let's take an example. We have a lot of good and bad stories. Let's take an example of Oman. I think we had a very wise leader, mm. okay, who there was uprising. There were demonstrations in the street. Look at the history, how he handled them carefully and how he, you know, reacted toward them. He didn't use force and he solved the problem and the country's moving very well, okay? 